Okay, we've got a quick video of uh, how we're testing two different types of solenoids. Um, these are Rostra solenoids out of a uh, A340 transmission. We've got a shift solenoid here, which is basically an on-off solenoid. And we've got a, the torque converter clutch solenoid. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hook up some air pressure here, about 70 psi pressure, and we're going to put about 10.4 volts of power through. Um, we tested 10.4 volts because that's the voltage that uh, a battery is flat at. So we're just going to test it at, at the minimum scale of, of the battery voltage. Now first of all we're going to check the specs on uh, the resistance on them. We've got the shift solenoid. So we're going to just put black on black. And we should have between 10 and 16 ohms for this particular solenoid on the A340 transmission. Got 12.6, so we're well within uh, the tolerances. The torque converter clutch solenoid. is going to be 12.7 so that that's well within those um, 10 to 16 ohm uh, tolerances and we've also got this torque converter clutch solenoid that that's a genuine one these other ones uh, aftermarket rostra ones and that one's 13.1 or 13 ohms there we go so that's the first check you should do make sure the the resistance is within the ranges and then now we're going to test the, um, the air pressure make sure it's working properly and not leaking. So I've got this little bracket I made up on the lathe. And we're going to test the, uh, the, the shift solenoid first. So I'm going to hook up our power earth to earth. There we go. We've got our air on there. Alright, we're going to apply the air. Now we've got 70 psi pressure of air going into that solenoid now. So there's nothing, you can't hear any leaks or anything like that. At 10.4 volts, we're going to hit the switch now. hear that leak opening when we put power to it. So this solenoid is actually normally closed uh, and when we put the power to it, uh, it opens. That one's operating quite well. We'll just put the voltage down even further and we'll put it down to about 9 volts, there's 8.8 8 .8 volts, and it's still working. Alright, now I'm just going to disconnect that, and we're going to put the torque converter clutch solenoid on. So same way, this is in, in an A340 transmission different solenoids, they operate the same or similarly alright 
Now we're, we're putting 70 psi pressure through there now, and that one's normally open. And now I'm going to yeah, we'll put the voltage back up, 10.4 volts. 10.5 and that one closes so when we put power to it it closes no power open power closed so there's the difference between those two solenoids. Uh, they look like they're the same or very similar but that's where you can get uh, into trouble. This is a shift solenoid that's got a orange wire on it on the A340 and the torque converter clutch solenoids have a blue wire. So if you mix them up um, the transmission is going to do very funny things. So this one normally closed when we put the power to it it opens and this one is normally open when we put the power to it it closes so it's very important to make sure you've got the right solenoid in the wrong right place and here we've actually got the torque converter solenoid the, the genuine one um, so believe it or not these two solenoids are the same just the, the rostra one has a little bracket on it like so a removable bracket or a universal bracket they call it and you can see that the the distance of the bolt hole which is there and the distance where the valve or the solenoid sits into the valve body um, is about the same so this just shows that those two solenoids are the same whereas these two solenoids are different these two are normally it's normally open which means when when the pressure's going through it which in this case, just for testing, is air. Um, the air will be passing through. I haven't got it applied at the moment. And then when we put electrical power to it, it'll close. There's the air going through it. And now I'm going to press the power. And it closes off. Open. Closed. No power. Power. No power. Power. So the difference with this, uh, with the rostra kit, um, they actually get you to bolt uh, that wire to the valve body. Where, whereas here, um, the, there's a little, a little, the wire instead of it going to this is actually um, soldered onto the body of the solenoid so you've only got one cable that goes into there which is this one and on this one you actually have to bolt it bolt it on whereas here it's already on that bracket there you go that's basically how you can uh, possibly test the solenoid yourself um, PWM solenoids are a little bit different. Um, what they do is when, as you ramp up the, the amperage, um, it, it'll actually close or open a, a port. So you can actually, through voltage, you can actually me meter it. So you can allow more air or oil or less air or um, oil pass through as you increase or decrease the amperage. Anyway, I hope that explains a little bit how solenoids can be look the same but are different or look different and they're actually the same. Okay, thanks for watching.